Hey guys, Terry Berger here with the Remax Luxury Homes Division in East Cobb. I hope you're having a great day today. Uh, thanks so much for diving into these videos. We're going to talk a little bit here about the price history and historical perspective in Chapter 1. I do want to uh, announce to you that I will not be speaking throughout most of these videos. Chapters 2, 3, and 4 that you're going to see are going to include um, some soft music playing underneath a slideshow of the homes that have sold, so you can see multiple pictures. But in, And then there will be features of that home listed on the right-hand side and underneath it. So you really don't need me to explain too much to you. If you have questions, of course, I would love for you to give me a call, but there's not going to be a lot of explaining that has to be done. But in this particular case, seeing as how I've been an agent for 10 years and I've seen the market before the decline and, uh, and after, I feel like I can give you some insight here. Well, first of all, let's look at the average home price by year in Northampton, going all the way back to 2004. And as you can see, in 2006 and 2007, that was the peak. There was great demand for homes in Northampton in 2006. And, uh, and most people would say that 2006 was the peak before we started to see some sort of decline in the market. And that's exactly what's taken place uh, in Northampton. If I open up the number of sales, where that was the average sales price, here are the number of sales. And what I just said is, is validated through the fact that there were 35 sales in 2006, 27 in 2007. In fact, there were almost as many sales in 2006 as, as there have been the past three years combined. If we put all of those numbers together so that you can see them in one graph, you'll see... Um, the, the demand, 35 homes in 06, 27 homes in 07, caused the prices to stay up. What is interesting to me is that, look, in, in 2008, only 10 homes in Northampton sold, but there wasn't really a great uh, price decline, maybe 2%. And then again, the market declined almost 4% in 2009, and now we're down another $16,000, which is uh, around 3%, 3, 3.2% in 2010. Now I will tell you this, there have been home sales in the high 500s, low 600s in Northampton in 2010. And 2010 as of the date of this recording is not over. There's three more months. So 2010 looks to be the best year that we've had since, um, uh, since the market took a dive back in 2007 and 8. So if you have any questions on the historical data sales data, please give me a call. If there's other information you would like, I'll be happy to pull that off for you. Just give me a call on my mobile phone, 678-665-5811. And I certainly hope you enjoy the rest of the chapters. If you're thinking about moving, I would just appreciate uh, if you'd give me a phone call. I'd love to sit down and chat with you about how things are going for you and your family and see if there's a way that the Remax Luxury Homes uh, Division can help you. Have a great day.